Existing security uh, features for the visa system for the Schengen area have been deeply compromised. Um, therefore, the updated security features are needed to combat counterfeiting. Hence the legislation for an improved uniform format for Schengen visas, which we're discussing today. Uh, the UK is not a member of the Schengen area and is not therefore participating in this legislation. The UK has its own national system for issuing visas and thankfully access uh, to the Schengen area does not give access to the UK, uh, at, at least not officially. Uh, it's good that the EU is trying to tighten up on illegal immigration, but since anyone who can make it across the Mediterranean in a boat is going to be admitted anyway, then the lines between legal and Ill illegal immigration become increasingly irrelevant. In fact, people smugglers are now putting only enough petrol in their boats to get them offshore so that the rescue services will automatically bring their car human cargoes ashore. Uh, it's now not so much a rescue service uh, as a taxi service for the last leg of the illegal migrants' journey. The big problem for the EU is the Schengen area itself, uh, which is a magnet pulling migrants to Europe. Once a migrant has achieved a foothold in the Schengen area, then it opens up the possibility of onward journeys to their desire, desired location. And although the UK is not part of Schengen, our border controls are extremely lax and open to abuse, to say the least. Our immigration system and border controls are in chaos. One simple indicator of this is to look at the official figures, or official migration figures, next to other known figures for migrants. In 2016, the official net migration figure was 273,000. However, the number of national insurance numbers issued to foreign nationals was 825,000. Clearly, something is wrong, uh, that there can be such an enormous discrepancy. A leak from the German government said that another 6 million illegal migrants are waiting to come to Europe this summer. The UK is not affected by this legislation, but UKIP M uh, is not affected by this legislation, and UKIP MEPs will therefore vote to abstain. Uh, but we wish you luck with sorting out your visa system, uh, because you're going to need it.